Today we have a couple of Air Force Ones with lace swaps. The Blazer Pack. Now they've released a few of these already. And this is the blue one right here. The Hyper Blue and Sail, as you can see. And we changed out the laces. In this case I chose a Converse Red Lace. Now I thought about whoever buys the red and the blue, you can just swap out the red for the blue. And it will probably look great. But I also want to change them up a little bit as we'll see. So in the blue ones I used a Converse 54 inch red lace. There you go. That's all the details I have about those. I buy my laces all around the world. I buy them all the time, not just for a particular shoe. I buy them and put them away. That way I've got boxes of these that tend to be lying around when I need them. Now what I looked at was these Blazer Air Force Ones. They're a GR. They're a very nicely done shoe. These here are a nice rough suede and we've seen them in many colors already. Today's release brought out the reds and the blues. I know the purples are up in Canada. I'd like to get them, but not for the prices that I've seen so far. And by mixing it up with a sail as opposed to a white, it really offsets these shoes. A nice summer shoe. In this case, the sail is the fat lace. So now I've got options for those highs that I bought, the fuchsias, and many others. On the back, we've got a, a typical GR-based leather. And then just that nice blazer suede all the way around. Now what I looked at was immediately, especially with 4th of July coming up, I thought, you know, the, the unicolor is great. I've got that blue right there. That's wonderful. But I just thought they would snap with a little bit of red in there. And I immediately thought about changing out the red laces for the blue and the blue for the red out of the two pairs. But as I said, I just want to do something a little bit different color to bring it out and put it where I thought it should be. Y'all may disagree, but I just had to break it up a little bit, and I didn't want to do it with just the, the fat laces with the sail. The sail colorway would have been nice. Uh, I'm just not real thrilled yet about the fat laces. I know that they were doing that back in the day, but when I think about fat laces, I always go right back to the Adidas. That's just me. What can I say? Overall, they do look very nice with either lace. But in this case, like I say, especially for July the 4th, I believe I'm going to go with these red laces. I try very hard to keep up with laces uh, when I can, whenever I see them at a Foot Locker, House of Hoops, any of the outlet stores, Converse, uh, Vans, any outlet store that's got laces. I always stop and look and I always pick up a few pairs, put them in buckets so I have them as I need them. Other than that, uh, Shoelaces Express, FullyLaced.com, and uh, Feet People are a few of my favorites. I always get asked where did the laces come from, so there you are. In this case, it's a Converse lace from the Converse Outlet Stores is where I got them from. Now, that does not mean that they're still readily available. I don't know. I pick them up all the time over the years. I get asked the same questions often, and unfortunately being a little bit stressed for time, I'm going to have to pick and choose which questions I'll continue to answer. If I give enough details in the video, I'll hope that that will answer anything before it's asked on some of the more common questions that I get. Not trying to be mean, I'm just running out of time to, well, basically answer the same questions over and over again. Those that follow the channel have seen it in the vids, seen it in the comments, seen it in many places. So help me pass along where I get my stuff. Great shoes. Perfect to get the pack. And we'll cover those laces here in a minute. As always, you can find me at samcolt12.com, Google Plus, Instagram, and video as well. Today, a couple of GRs from the Blazer Pack. I passed on the LeBron Denims. Yes, I passed on them. I didn't think that overall they were a good shoe. That doesn't mean I hate them. It just meant that they're not for me. I would rather the people that are going to wear them get them, and that left me out. I just thought the overall presentation of the denim itself was a little bit dull. 
compared with the rest of the shoe. The brown tongue just didn't really attract me. I wasn't uh, happy with that whole combination, so I passed on them. Now, that multicolor low that we saw on that, on that Braun MVP pack, championship pack, I'd love to get that if anybody sees it. I doubt that it's going to be readily available, so I'll probably get knocked out of the loop. Time will tell. Blazers, Air Force Ones, the blue shoes, good stuff.